Ciao friends, I'm Johnny LaPasta. Welcome to Virtual Yoga with me. I'm very excited to be guiding your practice today. For today's class, go ahead and grab two yoga blocks, and if you don't have those, no worries. Just grab a big pillow like the kind that you sleep on. If you'd like to move with the music that I've intended for class today, go ahead and click the Spotify link down in the description of this video and start the first song as we start the practice. Today is focused on going inward, tapping into the strength, the power, and the light that we all have within us, and using that to move through challenges. I look forward to seeing you. Let's begin. That. We'll start in a supported fish pose. Two options. If you have two yoga blocks, we'll use those. Put one block towards the middle back of your mat in the flat, long setting, and the other block towards the very back of your mat in the medium setting. Sit down in front of the blocks, bring the space between your shoulder blades to the lowest block, and the back of your head to the highest block. Allow your shoulders to droop down and your chest to splay open. If you don't have two yoga blocks, no worries. Use one of your bedroom pillows and lay that lengthwise and lay along the pillow so that your chest is elevated higher than your hips. Once you come into that space, start to release movements and find stillness. Start to allow your eyes to close and go inward. And just begin to breathe and integrate into this time and this space. To begin, take a deep breath in, fill up your lungs to your very fullest capacity. And hold your breath for three, two, one. Open mouth, exhale, let all your air go. Another like this, inhale, breathe into this time, this space, and the next hour for you. Hold it for three, two, one. Open mouth, exhale, release anything that does not serve, and fully arrive here and now on your mat. Begin to turn on and engage your ujjayi breath as you're ready. Inhales through your nose, and exhales through your nose. About four to six seconds in, and four to six seconds out. Give your breath a sound and a texture. Cultivate it deeper and deeper. And from there, friends, we layer on our greater point of intention and meditation for our practice together. Today's intention is inspired by one of my favorite quotes. It goes, You are the sky. Everything else is just the clouds. When there is thick, stormy cloud cover, it's very easy to become consumed with the darkness, with the storminess, with the cold. But we forget that the sun, the moon, the stars are still shining beyond that. And when the clouds move away, the sun, the stars, and the moon will still be there. And the same is true for us. Even though we might be in the clouds right now, it's just something we're moving through. We still have a light and a power that is constant within us. And we can use that to move through the clouds and eventually emerge on the other side. So here today, see the challenges of this practice as clouds. Even when it's struggle, even when it's tough, just breathe through it and know that you have what it takes to make it through to the other side and see the clear blue, see the stars, the moon, the sun again. Take another deep Ujjayi inhale and deep Ujjayi exhale. As you're ready, make your way up off of your pillow or your blocks. Move them all off to the side. And make your way forward to a tabletop, all fours. Stack your shoulders over your wrists, your hips over your knees, and find a flat spine as you exhale. Inhale, cow, vitalasana. Drip your belly down, bend your elbows, pull your chest through, and gaze forward. Exhale, cat, pull your belly to your spine, round your spine. Point your tailbone and crown of head down. Separate the space between your shoulder blades. Now, flow these two postures out of your own pace of breath. Add on any other movements you feel called to perform to warm up in this space. Link your breath and your body together. Have them move in synchronicity with one another. And layer on this greater intention. Inhale, go deep. Connect to that power, that light that exists within you. Exhale, breathe it around you. Charge it up. Move with it through the challenges, through your clouds. Start to even out your movements. If you took anything with a right or a left, find equality on both sides. Come back to neutral in the next four, three, two, one. 
Inhale, bird dog. Reach your right arm forward towards the front, thumb up like you're shaking someone's hand. Exhale, lift your left leg above the mat, left heel towards the back of the mat, pause. Flex your toes down and square your hip down. Remain here on the inhale, reach in opposite directions. Exhale, draw your elbow to your knee, underneath your body, belly up and in and round your spine. Two more times. Inhale, reach, extend, find length, expansion, stretch. Exhale, round, contract, build heat, power, and focus. Inhale, reach. Exhale, round. Inhale, reach, and listen for change. Exhale, reverse tabletop dancers. Bend your left knee, sweep your right arm behind you, grab onto your foot any which way that feels good. Start to kick your foot into your hand. Reach your knee back and your toes up and back. Roll your right shoulder blade down your back to open your chest forward. Breathe in. Exhale, kick your foot harder into your hand. Reach your toes higher. Feel the stretch in your left hip flexor, right chest and right shoulder. Without catapulting, inhale, release your right arm forward, left leg back. Slow control, hover. Exhale, tabletop, bring your hand down and your knee down. Inhale, bird dog. Reach your left arm forward towards the front, thumb up like you're shaking someone's hand. Exhale, reach your right leg above the mat, right heel towards the back of the room, pause. Flex your toes down, square your hip down. Remain here on the inhale, reach in opposite directions. Exhale, draw your elbow to your knee underneath your body, belly up and in, round your spine. Twice more, inhale, reach. Exhale, round. Inhale, reach. Exhale, round. Inhale, reach, and listen for the change. Exhale, reverse tabletop dancers. Bend your left knee, sweep your right hand behind you, grab onto your foot any which way that feels good. Begin to kick your foot into your hand. Reach your knee back and your toes up and back. Roll your left blade down your back to open your chest forward. Breathe in. Exhale, kick your foot harder into your hand, reach your toes higher. Feel the stretch in your right hip flexor, your left chest, and your left shoulder. Without catapulting, inhale, release your left arm forward, right leg back, slow control hover. Exhale, tabletop, bring your hand down and your knee down. Inhale, curl your toes. Exhale, downward facing dog, Adho Mukha Swanasana. Lift your hips, bring your gaze between your feet. Now find organic movement here. Walk out your down dog. Bend your knees, shake your hips, shake your head. Let the cracks and the pops go. Warm your physical body to go deeper in the practice and do whatever your physical best is for you today. Warm mentally and energetically to move into this empowered space, connected to that constant source of strength that you have. Invite stillness into your down dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, ragdoll uttanasana. Step your feet up behind your wrists. Bring your feet hips distance apart or as wide as your mat. Take a generous bend to your knees. Let your belly rest on your thighs. Let your head hang heavy. You can stay still or you can sway side to side. Release physical tension. Release mental, emotional blockages, distractions, and doubts. Those fall away here. Inhale, center. Exhale, release your hands down. Bring your left hand to the center of your mat, right underneath your face. Option to place a block underneath your left hand. Inhale, ragdoll twist. Bend your left knee, straighten your right leg. Reach your right arm high towards the sky. Pause and breathe. On your next inhale, reach up through your right finger skyward. Hold on your exhale. Suck your belly in. Roll your right shoulder blade towards the knife edge of the mat behind you to open your chest to the sky. Take a breath in. Exhale, release your right hand down. Switch out your hands on the mat or the block. Inhale, ragdoll twist. Bend your right knee, straighten your left leg, reach your left arm high, hold and breathe. On your next inhale, reach up through your left fingers towards the sky. Hold on your exhale, suck your belly in, roll your left shoulder blade towards the knife edge of the mat behind you to open your chest. Take another breath in. Exhale, release your left hand down. Inhale, turn your toes out, heels in. Exhale, frog squat. Drop your hips down towards the ground between your heels. Knees go out towards the side, hips open. We'll go back and forth a couple times like that. Inhale, lift your hips and fold forward. Exhale, frog squat. Come down, knees towards the side. 
Inhale, lift your hips, fold forward. Exhale, frog squats, come down. Inhale, lift your hips, listen for the change. Exhale, toe heel your feet to a comfortable distance. Toes can touch or hips distance apart, your choice. Take a long inhale and slowly rise, one vertebra at a time. Stack bone on bone on bone. As you come up to a strong standing position, your head is the last to come up. Once you're up at the top, inhale, roll your shoulders up by your ears. Exhale, draw your shoulder blades down your spine. And find standing at attention, Sama Sitihi. Bring your hands to your heart center and allow your eyes to close. Grip down to the four corners of your feet, physically into your mat. Energetically into this space of constant power and strength that you're stepping into, reconnecting with today. Pull this to your body and your being paused. Here, friends, we unite our class with breath and intention. We work beyond just physical exercise. This also is our moving meditation. To begin, open mouth, exhale, release all blockages, all doubts, all insecurities. Inhale, go deep, connect to that source of power and light that exists within you. Open mouth, exhale, breathe that around you, charge that up in this space, use it through the challenges of the practice. Last time, these same intentions plus any others you may have. Inhale, breathe them in. Visualize them. Hold them tight. Exhale, breathe them around you. Share them into your space. Blink your eyes open. Release your arms down. Inhale, mountain tarasana. Push your feet. Lift your arms. Bring your biceps by your ears. Pause, breathe, and build. Maintain the engagement of your lower body. Squeeze your thighs and your glutes. Pull your belly button to your spine. Knit your front ribs together and down. Descend your shoulder blades down your back so that you create a lengthy neck. Inhale, float your ribs from your hips. Scrub up a whole another inch taller. Exhale, exalted mountain. Take your right hand to the back of your left thigh. Reach your left hand up and back towards the right corner of the room and pause. So this is both a back bend and a side stretch all at once. Push down extra through your left toes. On your inhale, create space between your left ribs and your left hip bone. On your exhale, reach up and back by one more inch. Inhale, mountain tarasana, rise. Exhale, exalted mountain. Take your left hand to the back of your right thigh. Reach your right hand up and back towards the left corner of the room and pause. Once again, it's a back bend and a side stretch all at once. Push down extra through your right toes. On your inhale, create space between your right ribs and your right hip bone. On your exhale, reach up and back by one more inch. Inhale, mountain tadasana, rise. Listen close. Exhale, chair plane. Shift the weight into your heels. Bend your knees. Sit your hips back. Sweep your arms back. Bring your shoulder blades kiss and ignite through your triceps. Hold for a couple rounds of breath. Shift the weight into your heels so that your toes are lighter but still keep them down. Engage your knees and thighs closer together. Plug your shoulder blades together, down and back. Big move. Inhale, back bend. Push your heels. Squeeze your glutes. Cactus your arms and broaden through your chest all on the inhale. Exhale, forward fold. Dive straight through Tadasana down towards your mat. Bend to your knees. Fold in half at your hips. Release down with the flat spine. Inhale, halfway lift, Ardha Uttanasana, bring your hands to your shins, extend through the crown of your head, tabletop your back nice and flat. Exhale, squat and curl, plant your hands, lift your heels, round your spine, and form a little ball shape. Hold here. On your inhale, create space between each vertebra of your spine. On your exhale, tuck your chin to your chest tighter and broaden the space between your shoulder blades wider. All right, friends, we flow it and we add on to it. Inhale, mountain tarasana, drop your heels, roll up. Rise up, reach up, engage everything your feet through your fingers are on. Exhale, exalted mountain. Right hand down and back, left hand up and back. Inhale, mountain tarasana, rise. Exhale, exalted mountain. Left hand down and back, right hand up and back. Inhale, mountain tarasana. Exhale, chair plane. Bend, sit, and sweep. Inhale, back bend. Explode open. Burst the crowds into the light. Exhale, forward fold. Dive down fluid, smooth, confident. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, squat and curl. 
Listen for change as we add on. Inhale, halfway lift again. Exhale, high plank, dandasana. Plant your hands and set both of your feet back. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, lower all the way down to your belly. Flip to the tops of your feet. Glue your toenails down. Bring your hands by your chest and your elbows in. Exhale. Inhale, baby cobra, bhujangasana. Peel your chest from the mat. Little snow weight in your hands. Keep your gaze down so that your neck is long. Push your toenails down. Squeeze your thighs and glutes. Bring your shoulder blades kiss. Send them to the back. At the same time, raise your crown of your head towards the front. Inhale, peel up by one more rip. Exhale, release. Bring your left cheek to the mat. Let your arms go long. Let your heels flop open. Relax. Inhale, bring your chin to center. Interlace all ten fingers at your tailbone behind you. Palms touch. Exhale. Inhale, bound locust, Banda Shalambasana. Peel your chest up to the mat like cobra. Reach your bound fist back. Exhale, roll forward into your belly and float your legs up. So you're balancing on your belly and your hip bones now. Inhale, peel up, reach your fist back. Exhale, roll forward, lift your legs up. Take one more inhale, two fly higher. Exhale, release. Bring your right cheek to the mat, gaze towards the left, heels stop open and relax. Inhale, bring your chin to center. Plant your hands underneath your shoulders and tuck your toes. Exhale, down dog. Rise to a high plank or tabletop. Then lift your hips up and back. Inhale, gaze forward to the top of your space. Exhale, forward fold. Step, float, or handstand. Your choice to travel to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, mountain tadasana rise. Pull energy, earth, through your fingers. Exhale, exalted mountain to your right. Inhale, mountain, connect to your constant power. Exhale, exalted mountain to your left, release the doubt and the darkness. Inhale, mountain, find your light. Exhale, chair plane, charge it here and now. Inhale, back bend, burst open through the challenges you can. Exhale, forward fold, you will believe it. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, squat and curl. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank, dandasana. Plant your hands, set both feet back. Hold your high plank. Yearn your heels back. Reach the crown of your head forward. Draw the heels of your hands and your toes together. Nothing moves, but all muscles in between those appendages light up. Breathe. Holding a position like this can be extremely uncomfortable, and it's easy to feel like we might be here forever. Just like when we're in a storm, it's easy to think, wow, this storm will rage on forever and ever. But the storm always passes. We always find our way to the clear. Find that mentality, that trust here and now for four, three, two, and one. Inhale, shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga, lower halfway down. Keep your elbows narrow. Inhale, up dog, flip to the tops of your feet, shine your chest, spring your gaze forward. Exhale, downward facing dog, pull from your belly button and lift your hips. Take a rich breath in and a rich breath out. All right, friends, in my classes, we have two more sun A's. These sun A's are for you. It's your breath, your movements, you getting connected to your intention. Today, that intention is to connect to your lightness, your power, and take it with you through everything. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, forward fold. Step, float, or handstand to the top. Now you're on your own two full sun A's. You can do the exact same sun A that we just did. Or you can do something totally different and unique. It really doesn't matter to me. All I care is that you move with your breath. You take what feels right in your body. And today, rather than getting caught up in the doubts and the worries and the stress, get caught up in the belief and the trust that you're connecting to within. Once you are done, downward facing dog.
friends, I may not be able to see you, but I can confidently say beautiful movements and variations. So long as you're moving with your breath, and so long as you're meditating as you move on your intention, you're doing what we've come here to do. And that is to sweat and exercise, yes, but also to build within as well as without. Downward Facing Dog is where we reconvene in the next four, three, two, one. Downward Facing Dog. Take a rich breath in, open mouth exhale, and let go. All right, friends, we build the bulk of our class, our sunbeat. Again, no matter how challenging it becomes, know that those challenges, those clouds are temporary. You are the constant that can break through and shine on. Use that mentality as we go. Inhale, three-legged dog. Send your right leg high towards the sky. Exhale, bring your right knee to your left elbow. Cross your body, get the twist, stack your right hip under your left. Inhale, three-legged dog, send your right leg high. Exhale, low lunge, heel then toe, step through. Inhale, low lunge twist. Keep your left hand down, reach your right hand up, gaze up, pause and breathe. Very similar to ragdoll twist, which we did in Sun A earlier on in class. On your inhale, reach up through your right fingers. On your exhale, suck your belly in. Roll your right shoulder blade towards the ninth edge of the mat behind you to open your chest. Take another full round or so of breath. Inhale. Exhale, vertical twist. Keep your legs and your twist. Lift your shoulders up over your hips. Engage your core. Pause and breathe. Feel free to bend your left knee a little bit. Lean back to align your shoulders directly over your hips. Breathe in, lengthen through the crown of your head. Breathe out, rotate back by one more inch. Inhale, exalted warrior. Take your right hand to the back of your left thigh. Reach your left hand up, gaze up, breathe. Arch through your spine and broaden through your chest. Imagine that my palm is between your shoulder blades and I'm lifting you up out of your low back. Find that action, that expansion. Take a breath in. Exhale, crescent plane, hinge forward, swim your arms back, bring your shoulder blades kiss and ignite your triceps, pause and breathe. Find one long line of energy out your left heel back and reach to the crown of your head towards the front. Recall cobra and your spine, bring your shoulder blades kiss, send them down and back. At the same time, lengthen the crown of your head towards the front. Inhale, star. Cartwheel open to your left. Heels in, toes out, arms to a V. Pause and take up energetic space. Shoot energy through your toes to the bottom two corners of the room. Reach your fingers to the top two corners of the room. Take an inhale to get bigger and brighter. Exhale, skandasana to the back. Bend your left knee, straighten your right leg as you come down. Pause and breathe. Several options in skandasana. Your heel can be lifted like mine, or it can be planted. No right or wrong either is fine. You can have your hands up for a balanced challenge. You can place them down for support. If either of these variations feel too intense in your left knee or hip, you can stay up higher into a lateral lunge. Also a good option. Breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, warrior two to the front. Come up out of your skandasana. Pivot your stance and plug into your warrior two. Pause and breathe. Seal down into the knife edges of your feet. Lengthen through your arms equally, right and left. Gaze forward. Perhaps shut down your eyes. Now, friends, rather than being absorbed by the challenge, the sweat, the burn, can you stay connected to the power you have to endure and move through? Take a breath in. Exhale, extended side angle, Parjvakanasana. Bring your right elbow to your right thigh. Reach your left arm towards the sky. Stay rooted down into your left leg and lifted out of your right side body. On your inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. On your exhale, suck your belly in. Roll your left shoulder blade towards the ninth edge of the mat behind you to open your chest. Take another round or so of breath. Inhale, reverse warrior. Maintain the bend in your right knee. Reach your right hand up and back behind you like you're high-fiving someone. Take one more inhale to reach back and go back. 
Exhale, high plank. Cartwheel down. Plant your hands. Hold your high plank. Now, friends, this today is where we get a little bit funky and have a little bit of fun. Inhale, modified side plank. Drop your left knee down. Open to your right. Reach your right fingers up. Breathe. On your inhale, reach up through your right fingers on your right hip bone. Hold on your exhale. Pull the sides of your waist in. Take a breath in. Exhale, seated separate leg stretch. Come down to a seat off of your mat. Bring the sole of your left foot to your right thigh and then reach your right fingers back and left fingers forward. So it's like a Janu Shirshasana, seated separate leg forward fold, but we're going to stay up for it. Take a breath in. Breath out. We continue to get a little bit more wild, a little bit more fun. Inhale, stargazer. Circle your left hand behind you, plant it down. Push your left shin down. Lift your hips and chest up. Reach your right fingers forward towards the top of your space and breathe. So stargazer, this idea of looking up through any blockages into the sky, into those constants that are always there. Breathe in. Exhale, side plank, side crunch. Come back into a modified side plank. Then crunch your right elbow and your right knee together to contract your oblique. Inhale, extend, fingers forward, leg back. Exhale, down dog. Bring your hand down and your foot down. Lift your hips and gaze between your feet. All right. Breathe in and breathe out. That side one, we do side two. Inhale, three-legged dog. Send your left leg high into the sky. Exhale, bring your left knee to your right elbow across your body. Get the twist. Stack your left hip under your right. Inhale, three-legged dog. Send your left leg high. Exhale, low lunge. Shield and toe. Step through. In a low lunge twist, keep your right hand down. Reach your left hand up. Gaze up. Pause and breathe. Once again, your upper body is similar to the ragdoll twist we did towards the start of class. On your inhale, reach up through your left fingers. Hold on your exhale, suck your belly in. Roll your left shoulder blade towards the knife edge of the mat behind you to open your chest. Take another round or so of breath right here. Inhale. Exhale, vertical twist. Keep your legs, keep your twist. Lift your shoulders up over your hips. Breathe. Feel free to bend your right knee. Lean back to align your shoulders over your hips. On an inhale, breath grow tall through the cone of your head. Exhale, breath, pull your belly in. Twist back by one more inch. Inhale, exalted warrior. Take your left hand to the back of your right thigh. Reach your right hand up. Gaze up. Pause and breathe. Arch through your spine and broaden through your chest. Once again, imagine that I've placed my palm between your shoulder blades. I'm gently lifting you up out of your low back. Find the expansion. Take a breath in. Exhale, crescent plane. Hinge forward. Reach your arms back. Bring your shoulder blades kiss that ignite through your triceps. Pause. Find one long line of energy out your right heel to the back and reach to the crown of your head towards the front. Think cobra on your spine. Bring your shoulder blades kiss. Send them back and down. Inhale, star. Cartwheel open to your right. Heels in, toes out, arms to a V. Once again, pause, breathe. Energize into all four directions of the room. Inhale. Exhale, skandasana to the back. Bend your right knee, straighten your left leg, come down. Now you may find that this side is slightly different than the other side. Find that variation that works for you. Heel up or down, hands up or down. Lateral lunge option as well. Breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, warrior two to the front. Pivot your stance. Plug into your warrior two. Pause and breathe. Seal down into the knife edges of your feet. Lengthen through your arms equally, right and left. Gaze forward. Perhaps shut down your eyes. Now, friends, how can you start to find more faith that you will see that clear sky again? Start that mental shift here. Take it with you off your mat into this time. Take a breath in. Exhale, extend side angle, Parjva Konasana. Bring your left elbow to your left thigh. Reach your top arm towards the sky. Say power down to your right leg and lift it out of your left side body. Both of your sides are long and strong. On your inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. On your exhale, pull your belly in. Rotate your right ribs over your left to open your chest towards the sky. Take another round or so of breath. Inhale, reverse warrior. Maintain the bend in your left knee. Reach your left hand up and back behind you. 
High five the back wall. Take another inhale to reach back and go back. Exhale, high plank. Circle down, plant your hands, set both feet back and hold your high plank. Once again, friends, we get a little bit funky today. Inhale, modified side plank. Drop your right knee down. Spin open to your left. Reach your left fingers up and breathe. On your inhale, reach up through your left fingers and your left hip bone. Hold on the exhale. Pull the sides of your waist in for stability. Take a breath in. Exhale, seated separate leg, twist, stretch. Come down to a seat off of your mat. Reach your left fingers back and your right fingers forward. Hold. So bring the sole of your right foot to your left thigh, kind of like a seated separate leg forward fold, but our torso is up here. Inhale, star gazer. Plant your right hand behind you, fingers to a diagonal. Push your right shin down. Lift your hips up. Lift your chest up. Reach your left fingers forward. Gaze up towards the sky, through the clouds, through any blockages. Inhale. Exhale, side plank, side crunch. Come back through the side. Bring your left elbow and left knee together. Contract your oblique muscle. Inhale, extend your arm and leg in opposite directions. Exhale, down dog. Bring your hand down and your foot down. Lift your hips. Take a rich breath in. Open mouth, exhale, and let go. Drop down to child's pose. Take a moment, take a second. Catch your breath, calm your heart recenter and refocus your mind friends we begin to flow breath to movement and just like in life this flow is filled with challenges those challenges in a way are clouds that sometimes block out the light the clear but know that they are only temporary all you have to do is breathe through them move through them and eventually you will emerge on the other side of them perhaps even stronger than before Proceed with that mental strength and commit it to memory. Take a breath in and a breath out. Inhale, rise to tabletop. Exhale, downward facing dog. Lift up and back. All right, friends, we flow. Inhale, three legged dog, send your right leg high. Exhale, bring your right knee to your left elbow, cross your body and twist. Inhale, three legged dog. Exhale, low lunge, heel then toe, step through. Inhale, low lunge, twist, reach your right arm up. Exhale, vertical twist, lift your shoulders up over your hips. Inhale, exalted, reach up and back, expand through your heart. Exhale, crescent plane, hinge forward, reach both of your arms back. Inhale, star, burst open to your left, big and bright. Exhale, skandasana to the back, bend your left knee. Inhale, warrior two to the front. Pivot, plug in strong. Exhale, extended side angle, Parjva Konasana. Inhale, reverse warrior. Reach up and back, feel the stretch in your side. Exhale, high plank, come down. Inhale, modified side plank. Drop your left knee down, open to your right. Exhale, seated separate leg, stretch, twist, come down to a seat, right fingers back, left fingers forward. Inhale, stargazer, left hand down, lift your hips, your chest, reach your right fingers forward. Exhale, side plank, side crunch, bring your right elbow and right knee together. Inhale, reach in opposite directions. Exhale, downward facing dog, hand down, foot down, lift your hips. Inhale, three-legged dog, send your left leg high. Exhale, bring your left knee to your right elbow, cross your body. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, low lunge, step through. Inhale, low lunge, twist, reach your left arm up. Exhale, vertical twist, rise with strength and confidence. Inhale, exalted, open up, shine the light out that exists within you. Exhale, crescent plane, move through the challenges you can. Inhale, star, you are powerful, you are capable. Exhale, skandasana to the back, believe it. Inhale, warrior two to the front, plug into your potential. Exhale, extended side angle, stay the course. Inhale, reverse warrior, you have it. Exhale, high plank, no doubts. Inhale, modified side plank, right knee down, left fingers up. Exhale, seated separate leg, twist, stretch, left back, right forward. 
Inhale, stargazer. Place your right hand down. Lift your hips, your chest. Reach your left fingers forward. Exhale, side plank, side crunch. Bring your left elbow and left knee together. Inhale, extend. Exhale, downward facing dog. Come back through center. Lift up and back. Take a rich breath in. Open mouth. Exhale, let go. All right, friends. We go one more time through with minor add-ons. Listen for the changes. Believe in yourself. Inhale, three-legged dog. Send your right leg high. Exhale, bring your right knee to your left elbow. Cross your body, pause. We add on, inhale, falling star. Shoot your right leg out. Push your right hand down. Reach your left hand high. Arch through your spine and broaden through your chest. Take one more inhale, two, reach higher. Exhale, bring your left hand down. Inhale, three-legged dog, send your right leg high. Exhale, low lunge, step through. Inhale, low lunge, twist. Reach your right hand up. Exhale, vertical twist. Lift your shoulders up over your hips. Inhale, exalted. Shine the light. Believe in your light. Exhale, full airplane. Add on. Hinge forward through crescent plane. Then launch off onto your right leg. Left leg up. Hinge your body parallel. Now, your right knee can be bent here. It doesn't have to be completely straight. Once again, engage your shoulder blades together. Send them back and down. Breathe. Continue. You've got it. Inhale, star. Land and rise. You are the constant. Exhale, skin dust into the back. Don't forget it. Inhale, warrior two. Find the strength. Exhale, extended side angle. Use that strength. Inhale, reverse warrior. You've got it. Exhale, high plank. Inhale, modified side plank. Left knee down, right arm up. Exhale, seated, separate leg stretch, twist, come down, right back, left forward. Inhale, stargazer, left hand down, lift, arch, reach. Exhale, side plank, side crunch. Inhale, extend. Exhale, downward facing dog. All right, you got one more side, one more time. Inhale, three-legged dog, send your left leg high. Exhale, bring your left knee to your right elbow, cross your body, pause, add on, inhale, falling star, shoot your left leg out, push your left hand down, reach your right hand high, arch through your spine, broaden through your chest, inhale, reach higher, exhale, bring your right hand down, inhale, three-legged dog, send your left leg high, exhale, low lunge, step through, inhale, low lunge twist, reach your left arm up, exhale, vertical twist, shoulders over hips. Inhale, exalted. Reach up and back. Add on. Exhale, full airplane. Come through your crescent plane, then launch off onto your left leg. Reach your right leg up and hinge your body parallel with the mat. Pause. Now, once again, you can bend your left knee. It doesn't have to be completely straight. Find what is most stable for you. Belly up and in. Breathe and believe. Inhale, star to your right. Land and open. Exhale, skandasana to the back. Inhale, warrior two to the front. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, high plank. Inhale, modified side plank. Right knee down, left arm up. Exhale, seated separate leg, twist, stretch, come down to a seat, left back, right forward. Inhale, stargazer, last time. Exhale, side plank, side crunch, left elbow and left knee together. Inhale, extend. Exhale, downward facing dog, lift up and back. Rich breath in. Open mouth, exhale, let go. Drop to your knees. Take a seat, grab some water and towel off. Wonderful work, my friends. I know I threw a lot at you. That was kind of everything in the kitchen sink all together. But you took it and you breathed through it. You made it through. That's what it's all about. Moving through those storm clouds and eventually emerging through on the other side. Clear skies. All right, once you're towel them water, recline down onto your back as we move into a little bit more core. Make star pose on your back. So send your legs out wide to a V and reach your arms out wide to a V. Here we go. Star crunches. Lift up, then twist your right fingers towards your left toes. Lower back down, reach both arms back. Lift up, twist your left fingers to your right toes. 
lower back down, reach both arms back. Here we go. Up and twist. Down and reach. Up and twist. Down and reach. Double exhale. Double inhale. Double exhale. Double inhale. Keep going on your own. Now, friends, your challenge, see if you can use the strength of your core, belly down and in, sides of your waist in, to lift and lower you rather than the momentum of your arms. Work through the challenge. Work through the burn. Keep moving through the clouds. You will emerge. You are here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release. Wall to wall stretch. Reach your fingers towards the back. Point your toes towards the front. Arch your spine up off the mat. Big breath in. Big breath out. Extend both legs up towards the sky. Viparita Karani. Bring your hands down by your sides. Add a challenge. Lift your shoulder blades away from the mat and hover your hands. Extend your left leg long to the mat. Hover it a few inches. Scissor leg switches. Switch. Switch. Exhale. Exhale. Inhales to the center. Keep going on your own. Strive to keep your heels lifted as they come down to the ground. Pull your belly in. Knit your front ribs together and down. Keep breathing, friends. You've got it. You are the constant. This is only temporary. You've got this. You will make it through this. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release. Hug both knees in and squeeze. Rock and roll forward and back two to three times the full length of your spine. On your last time, cross your ankles, plant your hands, and make your way to a forearm plank. Come through a high plank, and then bring your forearms down to the mat, elbows straight underneath your shoulders. Walk your toes in so that your hips go up. Pause. Dolphin push-ups. Shishulasana. Shift your face forward towards your fingers. Now lift up. Forward, up, forward. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Push down through your forearms. Plug your shoulder blades down your back. Belly button up and in to help lift your hips similar to when you are going to a downward facing dog. Last four, last three, last two, and one. Exhale, puppy pose. Drop your knees down, send them wide. Walk your hands as far forward as you can. Bring your chest, chin, or forehead down towards the ground. Keep your hips high in the sky. Arch in your spine. Stretch in your belly, chest, and shoulders. Inhale. And exhale. Make your way up to a seat. Grab some more water and towel off if you need it. All right, friends. Once you are towel them water, we meet in a gorilla pose. And we continue on with the rest of our practice. Gorilla pose, wide stance, lift your toes, insert your hands underneath your feet, bring your toes all the way to your wrists, bend your knees as much as you need to, let your head hang heavy to stretch into your spine. Just massage out your fingers, hands, and wrists with the pressure of your toes and your feet. And then catch your breath and re-engage your ujjayi breath. And recommit back to your intention. The intention, friends, is to stay connected to that constant source of power, of strength, of light that exists within you. At times, it's so easy to get caught up in the dark and the storm. And we forget that that lightness, that power, that good consistency is still there beyond that storm. And we only have to stay connected to it to eventually get back to it. And that's your focus here. Release your hands. Toe heel your feet together. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair katasana. Shift the weight into your heels, bend your knees, sit your hips back and down. Exhale, eagle garudasana on your right. Cross your right arm under your left. Cross at your elbows, wrist palms touch, or you can grab opposite shoulders. Cross your right leg over your left. Your right toes can hover, kickstand, or double wrap behind your calf. Draw your elbows and knees down the center line of your body. Lift your elbows in line with your shoulders. Draw them forward and away to stretch between your shoulder blades. 
sit lower in your legs, grow taller in your spine, breathe. Inhale, chair, katasana, unravel, keep your depth low. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. Inhale, lean forward. Exhale, prayer twist. Parivrita Ukatasana. Hook your left elbow on the outside of your right knee. Keep your knees squeezed together in one line. Sit your hips lower than your shoulders. On your inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. On your exhale, pull your belly in. Push your right hand down into your left and rotate your heart closer to your thumbs to help you deepen your twist. Take another round or so of breath right here. Shift the weight into your right foot. Inhale, one-legged mountain, Ekapadatadasana. Lift your left leg up, undo the twist, reach your torso and your arms up, hold. Establish stability in your right leg. Push down through all parts of your right foot, pull the strength up your leg, and suck the muscles of your leg closer to the bone. Take an inhale. Exhale, standing splits. Send your left leg back. Slow descent, bring your hands down to the ground. If you have a block, you can always bring your hands to the block. It just brings the floor up to meet you. Take an inhale to lift your left heel a little higher. Exhale, jiva squat. Bring your left knee to the back of your right calf and bend your right knee as you come down to get lower. Inhale, standing split. Send your left leg up and back. Exhale, jiva squat. Bring your left knee to your right calf. Once more, inhale, standing splits. Exhale, jiva squat and hold. Root down through your left hand. Take your right hand, reach back and grab on to your left foot. It can be the inner arch or the knife edge. Inhale, revolve dancers. Slowly roll up, rise up, reach up, pause. Squeeze your knees together. Pick one point of focus with your gaze. If you would like to move further, inhale, reach through your left fingers. Exhale, kick your foot into your hand. Reach your knee back and your toes up and back. Similar to that reverse tabletop dancers we did at the beginning of our class, but now with this added balance challenge. Inhale, mountain. Drop your left foot down. Rise up, both arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Dive down into your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair, ukatasana. Sit back and sit low. Exhale, eagle, garudasana on the left. Cross your left arm under your right. Cross your elbows, wrist palms touch. Cross your left leg up and over your right. Your toes can hover, kickstand, or double wrap behind your calf. Draw your elbows and knees down the center line of your body. Lift your elbows in line with your shoulders. Draw them forward and away to stretch between your shoulder blades. Sit lower in your legs. Grow taller in your spine. And breathe. Inhale, chair, katasana, unravel. Keep your depth low. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. Inhale, lean forward. Exhale, prior twist, parivita ukatasana. Hook your right elbow on the outside of your left knee. Keep your knees squeezed together in one line. Sit your hips lower than your shoulders. On your inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. On your exhale, pull your belly in. Push your left hand down into your right and rotate your heart closer to your thumbs to help you deepen your twist. Shift the weight into your left foot. Inhale, one-legged mountain, Ekapada Tadasana. Lift your right knee up, undo your twist, reach your torso and your arms up, and hold. Establish stability in your left leg. Suction cup your left foot down. Pull the strength up your leg and draw the muscles of your leg closer to the bone. Take a breath in. Exhale, standing splits. Send your right leg back. Slow descent and the bottom of your exhale. Bring your hands down to the ground. Option to place a block underneath your hand. Take an inhale to lift your right heel a little higher. Exhale, Jiva squat. Bring your right knee to the back of your left calf. Bend your left knee to squat down a little lower. Inhale, standing split. Send your right leg high. Exhale, Jiva squat. Last one. Inhale, standing splits. Exhale, Jiva squat. Now root down through your right hand. Take your left hand. Reach back up onto your foot. It can be inner arch or outer edge. Lighten the weight in your right fingers. And inhale, revolve dancers. Very slowly, roll up, rise up, reach up. Once you're up at the top, squeeze your knees together to begin. Pick one point of focus with your gaze. As you'd like to move further, inhale, reach up through your right fingers. Exhale, kick your foot into your hand. Reach your knee back and your toes up and back. Inhale, reach. Exhale, kick. 
and inhale, mountain rise. Spring right toes down to meet your left, left arm up. Exhale, forward fold, dive down into your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale your way back to a downward facing dog. You can move through the Chaturanga Dandasana, or you can simply step back and did downward facing dog your call. From downward facing dog, inhale three legged dog, send your right leg high into the sky. Exhale swan, bring your right knee to your right thumb. Lower your right thigh upon your calf. It's as if you're folding your leg into a more compact piece. Walk your hands by your hips. Inhale, lift your chest like an upward facing dog. Exhale, sleeping swan. Walk forward and down. You can come down to your forearms or your forehead. Feel free to utilize a block or a pillow underneath your head and relax. This is similar to a half pigeon, but a little safer and more sustainable for your hips for long term practice. Inhale, plant your hands, straighten out your arms, tuck your left toes. Exhale, three-legged dog, send your right leg up and back. Feel free to shake out your leg, scorpion flip dog, whatever movements you need. We'll meet back in downward facing dog. From down dog, inhale, three-legged dog, send your left leg high into the sky. Exhale, swan. Bring your left knee to your left thumb. Lower your thigh upon your calf. Again, it's as if you're folding your leg into a smaller piece. Walk your hands by your hips. Inhale, lift your chest like upward facing dog. Exhale, sleeping swan. Make your way down onto your forearms or your forehead. Utilize your props as you see fit and breathe. Now, once again, friends, you are the sky. Everything else is the clouds. No matter what you're moving through in life, you will get through it. Everything is temporary. You, as a being on this earth, in this lifetime, are the constant. You may be in the throes of challenge, of opposition right now, but eventually you'll emerge on the other side of that and see the clear. Now it's about staying connected to that faith, to that strength, and having patience as you go. That's what you've practiced here on your mat. And now it's about taking that with you off your mat and into your world. Inhale, plant your hands, straighten out your arms, tuck your right toes. Exhale, three-legged dog, send your left leg up and back. Once again, feel free to scorpion, flip dog, do whatever you need. We'll meet back in down dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, Drop down to your knees and come to a stand on your knees. Bring your knees hip distance apart. Stack your hips over your knees and your shoulders over your hips. Bring your hands to the small of your back. Point your fingers down as if they're going into pockets. Try and make your elbows disappear behind you. Inhale, bring your gaze up to a spot on the ceiling right above you. Exhale, Kamal Ustrasana. Very slowly walk your gaze down the ceiling one inch at a time. As your gaze goes back, Send your hips forward and up. Lift your chest up. Stay lifted out of your low back. Big arch in your spine. Either continue with ujjayi breath or take tiny sips of air. But keep breathing. Inhale, slowly walk your gaze back forward till your chin is level. Exhale, have a seat on your heels, bring your hands to your thighs, allow your eyes to close, and let any sensations that arose pass. Blink your eyes open. Come to a seat and extend both legs long in front of you. Zip up your legs together as one. Flex your toes back towards your shins. Reach your arms up overhead. Inhale. Exhale, seated forward fold, Paschimottanasana, fold forward, bend your knees as much as you need to to grab onto your feet. Today I invite you to tuck your chin to your chest and bring your forward towards your knees. 
Find length down your spine, across your low back, and in between your shoulder blades. Inhale, slowly roll up one vertebra at a time. Suck bone on bone on bone. Scooch forward so that you have plenty of mat space available behind you. And lower all the way down to your back on the mat. Hug both knees into your chest and give yourself a squeeze. Bring your forward up to your knees. Flex your toes back towards your face. Squeeze into a tight, tiny ball. Exhale, Shavasana. Allow your legs to go long and your arms to go long. Release your movements. Find stillness. Keep external thoughts at bay. Stay present in silence. Here, friends, for the first part of your Shavasana, I will guide you through a visualization meditation. And then I will give you time to drift off on your own. Visualize in your mind's eye a clear sky above you. Take in all the details of this sky that your imagination is painting. It can be a daytime sky, blue and sun. It can be a nighttime sky, dark blue, stars and moon. Just watching your clear sky. See a fog, a mist, roll in from the sides of your vision and lightly veil the sky. You can still see through this veil of mist or fog to the sun or the moon or the stars, just not quite as clearly. But as you watch, you notice that this fog, this mist, starts to break up, dissolve. And eventually, the sky is clear again. You continue to watch your clear sky and as you do, big, fluffy white clouds roll in. They block out patches of your view. As you keep watching, those clouds too blow out with the wind to the side, and the clear sky is revealed again. You watch your clear sky, and soon, dark, thick, swirling storm clouds come in and completely block the view of your clear sky. There's thunder, lightning, rain. It goes on for some time. But soon, those clouds lose their thickness, lose their darkness, begin to break up, begin to dissolve. And once again, there is the sun, or the stars and the moon, still shining bright, untouched. And now just be with this sky of yours, and let everything else melt away. Feel free to remain here in Shavasana for as long as you would like. If you would like to exit with me without moving a muscle, take a soft inhale and a soft exhale. On your next inhale, invite gentle movements back. Bring wiggles to your fingers and your toes. Bring rotations to your wrists and your ankles. Gently rock your head side to side on the mat. Move into a wall-to-wall -wall stretch. Reach your fingers towards the back. Point your toes towards the front. Arch your spine up off the mat. Gather your knees into your chest. Give yourself a squeeze. Roll to your left side in the fetal position. Use your left bicep as a pillow. Plant your right hand down on the ground as a base. Take a moment and a breath. And when you're ready, make your way up to a comfortable seat. 
eyes remain closed and bring your hands to heart center. We end our practice as we began it with breath and intention. Open mouth, exhale, let all your air go and anything else that you need to release. And one last time together. Inhale, breathe into this space of constant strength, power, and light. Open mouth, exhale, take that with you as you leave the confines of your mat. Bring your thumbs to your third eye center, space of enlightenment and intuition. Loka Samasta Sukinu Bhavantu. May all beings everywhere be happy and free. And may the words and actions of our own lives somehow contribute to and impact that same happiness and freedom. From this space, we bow forward to seal our practice. The highest in me sees and honors the highest in you. Namaste. Thank you so much for allowing me to guide your practice. It was my honor. If you enjoyed this class, please like the video, comment on it, and if you feel inclined, share it out into the world. I'd also love it if you would subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you can stay up to date with all my latest class offerings. And I look forward to flowing with you again soon. Namaste.